Hey guys, Larry the Tractor Guy here. Working in the shop this morning on a Saturday morning on a uh, transmission job that I've got going on here. And I wanted to show you real quick. I've got a little leakage around this pump drive housing bolted onto the range box of this 7200R here. And I really wanted to remove that and uh, fix that leak while we're into this transmission. But however, I really didn't want to remove the pumps. I wanted to remove this as a complete unit. Um, without having to um, remove the pumps. But what I'm running into here is that these bolts take an 18 millimeter and I just don't have enough there to be able to break those bolts loose because the housing, if, as you can see, kind of sticks out here and it's sort of in my way. So I realized that I had ordered some box in offset wrenches. So check these out here, um, offset box in wrenches. So. There's my 18 millimeter. And uh, we're gonna walk over here, show you how that works. Cause it's a really cool set of wrenches. If you don't have a set of these, man, these are really cool. It's got a pretty good offset there. And uh, as you can see, it fits right in there and it clears the housing here where I was able to break that, that bolt loose and then really able to get on the next bolt fairly easy as well. <clears throat> and so, that's a pretty cool wrench, pretty cool set of wrenches. I bought these off of Snap-on, but, but there's uh, various different companies out there that make these offset wrenches. So if you're looking for a quick alternative to save a little time, get you a box-in offset wrench. Tech tip of the day from Larry the Tractor Guy, signing out. Hey guys, check out Larry the Tractor Guy videos here, other videos here, subscribe here, and buy all your John Deere parts here. We'll make it work. I think we're gonna have to make it. We'll make it work. Come on, let's go. We need to make you need some bloopers. Y'all already burning me out. Some bloopers. He's sitting in the sun over here, man.